Hey, today a super quick video to highlight a project that I think is very, very nicely done. After the release of Windows 11, which you probably know about, there was a lot of requests to implement a feature from that OS, which was right clicking on the maximize button of any Windows actually raises up a menu that uh, where you can actually select where to tile the window, so to the left, to the right, or in various uh, ways. And that was asked a lot. And I think there was even some uh, short discussion on whether it was actually feasible. And luckily such a change would require some a lot of Kwin, which is the window manager for KDE changes. And Kwin is generally the project that you want to remain as stable as possible. So nothing really happened. However, Kwin is meant to be very extensible via scripts and plugins. And somebody actually did a script that does basically when, what Windows does. It's not exactly the same, but it's very, very nicely done. So just as a quick info, how do we actually um, install uh, a Kwin script? Uh, I'll show you the uh, what I'm talking about, which is this one. And I'm showing you how to actually get it immediately. You just go into settings, you go into window management, then Kwin scripts, and then get new scripts. And you get exquisite, it's called immediately after you open it. So it is super easy. You don't have to have a browser or anything. You just open system settings. You do need internet, obviously. Once you get it, uh, it works out of the box and it's pretty simple. You bring it up with Control Alt D like this. And you have all of the ways that you can uh, set up your windows. And there's also the ability to restart Kwin if you're uh, experiencing any bug. Uh, if you're on Wayland, you can try it. I, I, I'm too scared <laughs> to even click that button because usually Kwin on Wayland in the past was not a, was had, hadn't the capacity to restart. Now it should have it. So, but I leave it to you. So you also get a button that tells you how this works by linking to the GitHub page, which I already have op open, and then you just click uh, the. I mean, where you want to tile is pretty self-explanatory, I think. There are a lot of very nice um, options. You also get the option to install a widget and then activate and disactivate it using uh, that widget, just clicking on it. And after you install it, so in system settings, you can actually customize it a lot. I've seen a lot of options and now I'm gonna show them to you. In here, you've got uh, the number of columns, uh, the position of uh, the plugin, so an, as an example, uh, to actually apply the settings, I think you do need to disactivate it, uh, sorry, apply and then activate it again. I think that's a set, yeah, see, now it's on the top, similarly to KRunner. Uh, and then you customize every button, every thing. So you can close it after telling a window, I do want that, so I'm uh, turn that on. This is the um, GitHub page. You don't even have to open it to install this. So if you just want to give it a go real quick, you can just open up uh, system settings, but you can go through it and uh, it, it is very, very nicely done. I don't know what else to say. So <laughs> congratulations to this project and uh, I hope to see more Kwin scripts like this. So check it out.